Darn! 60 hertz, 60 schnurts, am I right? Well, this is a problem of the past, my friends, because I'm going to show you this one simple trick that will half your input lag. Doctors hate it. You want to go to settings, click graphics, advanced, turn vertical sync off, and you will be shredding away, my brother. Just get a load of this. That easy, son. You see what I'm saying? I know what you're thinking. I know what you're thinking. Sounds great and all, but where's the proof, huh? How do I know you're not a phony? You're not a scammer? This ain't no hoax. Well, let me tell you. I grabbed my phone. I recorded in slow motion at 240 FPS. I clicked my mouse, and I counted how many frames it took for the spider to teleport after I clicked the mouse. With the vertical sync on, it took a whopping six frames. You do not want that. That's like a tenth of a second. When I turned it off, well, it took three frames. That's blazing fast. Plenty of speed to slay demons like Bloodbath. Now, it ain't all fun and games with this crazy technique. There are some downsides to it. Audio jungle. The most noticeable one is screen tearing. When I do this, I get like a big line between frames it's i don't know how to explain it but like it slowly moves up the screen if you turn it on you'll see it you'll know it when you see it trust me this also won't make a massive difference if you have some crappy mouse a piece of crap some crappy crap brother some stupid crap if your mouse is any of those this might not make a very big difference if you have a decent gaming mouse like i have the razer basilisk v2 it should half your input delay. And this works on high refresh rate monitors, but the latency on those already isn't really a problem. There's also no VSync option on iOS, so you can't really do this. Thank you for watching. Please comment down below to have a chance at winning 100,000 wasps.